All right. So I read audio forums and audio groups on Facebook, and I see people say all the time, oh, normalization will fuck up your audio. This is not true. All the normalization does is change the level, and I can prove it. Okay, so we have a kick drum. Okay. That's pretty straight ahead. Let's make a copy of it. Move it down to here. Now we've got double the level. All right. Now, let's put a uh, polarity reverse in Logic. That's the gain plugin on one of these. And we'll reverse the polarity on the left and the right. Same level. And now we will hear nothing. Now, I'm not doing any trickery. Watch, I'll bring this gain up a little bit. But the moment the, the, the levels are identical, then this one nulls with this one. That means those files are identical. That's what that means. If they null, they're identical. The waveforms on the top one will go up and down like this, and the other one will do the reverse, the exact opposite on the waveforms, which makes them cancel each other out. So this is basic. All right, so now let's bring the gain of this one down 10 dB. All right, so here's the original. Here's the 10 dB down one. They're identical other than level. Now I'm going to bounce this. Oh, I can prove that they're identical other than level by giving this minus 10. And now we get nothing. All right. Complete cancellation again. All right. Now let's take this one. This is the lower one, and we're going to bounce it. We'll call it normalized. And we're going to bypass the effect plugins, of which there are none. We're going to put normalization on. Okay. All right, let's take our gain plugin and we'll put it on our normalized track. And we'll compare it to this one. And when we get it to minus 10, look at that. Nothing on the stereo bus. They're nulling. So what does that tell us? Well, we've got polarity reversed on this one and not reversed on this one. That means that they're canceling out completely. That means they're identical files, identical audio, except for level because we've changed the level. We've matched the level using the gain plugin. So you see, normalization only changes the level. It does not adjust the audio in any way. It does not limit it. It does not compress it. It does not destroy it. It does not degrade it. It does nothing to it other than to change the gain. No different from changing your fader. No different from changing your gain. And the reason that you would use normalization is if you want to set a, a specific peak that uh, is a certain percentage under zero dBFS. Like I said, I don't normally use normalize, but you do not need to be afraid of it. It will not destroy your audio ever. Okay, that's it. Like, subscribe, you know the drill. And when you see someone post about normalization and they say, don't normalize, it's gonna screw up your audio, give them this.